So what we found um, by looking at this extreme heat, particularly over Iceland, but we also looked over uh, over parts of Greenland, that it was a uh, it was an absolute record breaking event. So it was much hotter than May has ever been in Iceland. Uh, at least so the sort of it was the hottest one week that Iceland has ever had in May. We found that even in today's climate, that is still a relatively rare event. So expected about once in a hundred years, which obviously doesn't mean it happens every hundred years, but in any given year, there's a 1% chance of such an event happening. But without human induced climate change, such an event would have been basically impossible to occur. Arctic amplification simply means that um, the further away from the equator you go, the stronger um, temperatures from, from climate change increase. And, and so that's why we see um, around the Arctic Circle, we see uh, that, yeah, temperature has increased not by 1.3 degrees as it has on a global average, but more by something like three or four degrees. With this study, it is super obvious, as, as you've said, with the melting of the Greenland ice sheet, the potential impacts on the on the global ocean circulation, that that basically is an extreme event that affects the whole world, even though most of the people on this planet won't have won't have heard of this heat wave.